Why do we hate our own voice? Have you ever recorded your sound for your voice and after playing it back thought, why do I sound like a clown? Well, hating your recorded voice isn't a sign of fragile self-image. It's a simple byproduct of the weird way our brains sometimes work. To understand this interesting phenomenon, first we have to understand how exactly we hear our own voice. When we speak, our voice travels from our vocal cords to our mouth then through the bone and cartilage in our skull and finally reaches our ears. This process is called bone induction, so the voice you hear is not your real voice, it's an altered version. It's a mix of your voice traveling and reverberating through the air combined with your bone inducted voice. This is the reason when you hear your recorded voice, you think that it may be funny or even unpleasant. So at the time of recording, you hear your mixed voice, but the recorder is actually recording your real voice, which is coming directly from your mouth to the microphone. And when you hear the same recording back, you expect to hear your mixed voice, but you hear your real voice instead. And while listening to our recorded voice, we expect a voice like this. But we hear a voice like this, and that's why we feel uncomfortable. This happens because our voice doesn't sync up with what we're used to hearing and what we expect to hear. So the first impulse is to just dislike it. But your recorded voice is in fact your real voice, so don't hate it. It's just that your brain is not conditioned to process it on a regular basis. This is the reason why most celebrities hate their own voice, but we enjoy listening to them. And this is how I always make my logic.